Hello, everybody. It's Charlie again, and I am currently playing Midnight Fight Express. And this is an indie game made by one person, guys. That when I saw the trailer, it blew my mind, and I thought it was only going to be out for PC, but I was wrong. It came out for the PlayStation. I saw it on the PSN by complete accident. I was just looking for what new stuff or games are available, and it's been out since August, as you, some of you are probably telling me. But I was not aware. <laughs> I thought this game was never going to come out. And just by the fighting mechanics, I was intrigued. And I was like, I got to play this when it comes out. And I finally got my hands on it. So I'm very excited. Other than that, guys, let's get into it. Hope you guys enjoy. It's no use going back to yesterday. Because I can't read the whole thing, guys. Sorry. So baby face, right? I'm just going to call you that since our records sh don't show anything else. Kind of like your ghost. We don't like ghosts. They have a tendency to cause trouble and disappear, classic ghosts. Now listen up. You claim innocence. No memory from before the attack began. Say you were just trying to help. But we know that isn't true. You're part of this whole thing. The attack on the city, mobilizing the gangs, all of it. What we don't know is why. If we figure out the why, we figure out the how, and we can stop the how. Come on, buddy. Tell us the why. Help us save the city, and maybe you won't get the death penalty. Maybe. Start at the top. Retrace your steps. Everything you can remember might help us figure out exactly who you are. Don't hold back, or else we certainly won't. Now, what's this about a talking drone? Ooh, it's getting, it's already starting off good. I'm excited, guys, because this looks like a whole different kind of fighting, well, not fighting game, but beat em up, you know? Um, just the mechanics in general, from the trailer at least, impressed me. It looks so much more realistic than anything I've seen. Yes, guys, including Sifu. Sifu is still. Even though this, yeah, yeah, I get it. You're probably going to say, well, the graphics. I'm like, yeah, but there's something about the movement that feels realistic. I saw a bunch of videos on this. And I've just been dying to play. Hold on. What? Interact with, oh, the TV? Okay. It's chaos. Utter relentless chaos. A citywide takeover. Perpetrated by power-hungry lowlifes. Do not, I repeat, do not go to civilian evacuation sites. There are honeypots for the vulnerable and, pig and panicked. They don't want anyone leaving the city. These criminals, they're everywhere. And I mean everywhere. Even, oh no, they're here. They're in the building. Oh shit. To anyone out there still alive and watching, trust nobody. Save yourselves. And remember, this programming was made possible by generous, caring viewers like you. Oh, I got a package. Amazon's still good, though. Hey, babyface, yeah, you? Let me out of here. Oh, it's a person in the box. Hold on a second. Who you? Oh, shit. Too slow, friend. No time to waste. Wow, this is your place. No cult of personality concerns here. They really drained that noggin of yours. Oh, we can fix that. But first, don't think I need to tell you, tell ya, our beautiful city of tomorrow's gone to all sorts of hell. Could really use a little saving. So here's the deal. You're a sleeper agent, a brutal mercenary in a trance, waiting for a drone in shining armor like yours truly to wake you from this dry little dream. I only ask one itsy bitsy favor in return. Help me save this, this city and all the good-hearted schmucks in it before sunup or the crooks will get full control. Do that, you get your real life back. And the city sees a brighter tomorrow after all. Now let's get moving. Won't be tomorrow if we, if we don't get our shit together today. At least not the kind of tomorrow you want to see. Okay, well that, that, that drone has a bit of a... He thinks he's human. 
Hold on, let me at least check the room real quick. I don't want to miss anything, but there's people in the other rooms. Hopefully, hopefully this is not too ridiculously hard to learn how to play. Because that's another thing about these kind of, kind of beat-em-ups. Well, there isn't anything like it that I've seen, but you guys know, like a top view beat-em-up. Um, the mechanics can be kind of confusing sometimes, depending on the layout of the buttons and stuff. You guys know what the hell I'm talking about. But yeah, I've been waiting for this game for like two years, man. Oh, almost forgot. Gotta reactivate, yeah. Applying a little noise cream, <laughs> okay. Should warm those muscles right up. The drone is a little bit of a pervert. What are you talking about? Oh, shit. Oh, hell yeah. Oh, hell yeah. Motherfucker knows parkour, too? Oh, I'm down. Oh, the guys, the music is bumping. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. Wee! There we go. I'm like a fucking superhero. Uh, our first batch of bozos. Our hunting civilian should be no trouble for you. Introducing bozos. That's that's funny. Can't believe that one guy made this. That's crazy. Bitch, bitch, bitch. Holy shit, this is hard hitting shit. It feels good, it feels good. It feels just as good as it did when I first saw the trailer. Ooh, it's all coming back to you now. Huh? More ahead. Something tells me you got this. Well, let's see. I mean, I have no guarantees, you know what I'm saying? Oh, these are the bad boys. Oh, shit. And what? L1? Okay, what? Remember to keep an eye on your health bar. Our lower difficulties health is partially regenerated over time. Oh, really? Oh, fuck. Wait, what was the L1 for? Oh, fuck it. Let's beat some ass, bro. I don't have time for this counter shit. Beat down city. Holy shit. It feels really good to beat the fuck out of these guys. <laughs> and the music is bumping, man. This is good shit. I ever played two games in a row already. Doom Eternal's on fire, by the way. That shit's gonna be on my channel permanently. Even after I beat it, I'm gonna keep playing. There's a horde mode. There's all kinds of modes. And I'm guessing this game also has variety, so... Shit, I'm so happy. Such a good time to be a gamer, guys. Holy shit. Okay, tough. Okay. I gotta counter at the right time, let's see. How the fuck do I take these guys up? What does it say? Oh, heavy strikes. Yeah, that's what I've been doing. Bro, I blocked your ass. Don't, don't even, don't bullshit me. Okay, okay, this is this is tougher than I thought. There's a, there's a learning curve. Oh! Okay, let's see. Let's see if I can time it. Come on, fucker. Okay. Okay, dude. Come on, fucker. Bro, that guy hits hard as fuck. He's backing me up when he hits me. Oh, see? You gotta do it. You gotta be snappy. Ah. Uh. It's, it's kind of a weird countering system. It's not like Batman or anything like that or Spider-Man. Look at you knocking skulls, champ. The basics are in your blood. You still got a whole lot to remember. Memories and moves. But you'll get there in time. For now, let's see what sort of sorry excuses for criminals we got behind door number one. The drone is uh, pretty funny. <laughs> this is like a fucking 80s action movie, early 90s. It's kind of cool. You know what? We got here, boys. Just some pathetic prick thinking he could buy us all. Sneak his family out safe and all. Don't you get it, asshole? They're already buried in a pit somewhere. It's time you join them. Oh, hell no. 
Now that's a kind of dirtbag fuckery <laughs> that really gets the blood boiling. What say we turn up the heat? Rage? The rage meter will build up with engage in combat. Rage enhances the power of your combat abilities for a short time. Fuckers. Messing with people, huh? Come on, fucker. Let's go. Let's go. Let me counter that motherfucker. Yeah, I just wanted to do that spinning back kick. So yeah, after you counter with triangle, you have to press L1 at the right time. Look at you shaking, rage style. Yeah, we can use that. Time to hulk out on some bozos. Sounds good. I like how you can interact with the chairs and shit in the boxes. That is nice. The doors automatically open when you go through them. That makes things a lot easier. You hear all that commotion? No pizza delivery, idiot. Forgot the pie. Let's take our... Oh, okay. When your rage meter is full, rage mode will activate automatically for a short period. Oh, that's perfect, because I don't want to be thinking about having to press something. Whoa, whoa, whoa. That's badass. Wow. Motherfucker is a savage, but... And yes, I'm all about variety and fighting. I noticed some videos don't want to put all the stuff that the game allows you to do. So I'm going to be doing that in my video. Some enemies are stronger than others and require you to break their defensive stance in order to take them vulnerable to attacks. That reminds me of Sleeping Dogs a little bit, but in a totally different way. It's kind of interesting. Let's fucking wreck your friends, bitch. See, I'm always ready with the block line. You guys know that? That's from experience in fighting games. It's like the counter button in Batman, really. But, it works slightly different, really. Yeah, bitch. Bitch! That's spinning back kick. I know you unlock moves, I, I guess, as you go on, but... So far, it's... It feels good for just the beginning of the game. Oh shit. I got a, I got a fucking dodge button? Oh hell yeah, now we're talking. <laughs> nice try, bitch. Poor guy, can't save them all. But we can sure as hell try. So they killed him, okay. Pick up a weapon. Melee weapons have limited durability and will break after a few hits. Okay, classic uh, video game shit. Oh, hell yeah, it hits hard as fuck. Oh yeah, those guys are regretting this shit. What the fuck? Don't come any closer. Or I'll slit this asshole's throat with my... Dick? No, I mean wrench. Fuck! <laughs> Alright, let's see. Perfect. Throwing weapons at enemies will temporarily stun them and break their attacks. Different throw weapons has various effects against enemies. Okay. Uh, but he did kill his hostage though. That kind of sucks. I forgot. I skipped a certain part, but it's okay. But I digress. Got more bozos out those doors. Let's treat them to sh to the to a show. Hey, motherfuckers! Focus allows you to scan the environment and enemies around you. Fill up the focus bar by landing successful attacks on enemies. Holy shit! That's awesome. This is hard. I don't know what I, what I have in my hand. Oh, I'm gonna be picking up weapons. Weapons work very well in this game. That was grade A precision right there. Never seen anything like it. Why don't we make a memory out of this beautiful moment, huh? I can snap a photo or two for ya. And then we bash a few more heads, yeah? Okay, Mr. Drone. Uh, what is that? I can't believe there's a photo mode in this game. That's pretty funny. 
Zoom out. Oh, you can take another one from there. Let's see, zoom in. Yeah, exit. There you go. Oh, hey, fucker. What are you doing here, you fucking sick fuck? World's your oyster, friend. Leaving you pearls of pain all over. Like that chair. A real killing tool, if you ask me. Okay, I'm, take, I'm using the chair. Some environmental objects can be picked up and thrown at enemies. Use focus to easily identify them around you. Well, let me throw this at him first. There we go. I can pick up the chair. Okay, so the heavy ones, you can only momentarily pick them up to throw them immediately. Okay, there we go. Fuck you, bitch. Witch. This game plays really well, guys. I don't know what to tell you. I'm kind of shocked that there's one person that made this. Very impressed. I wish I remembered his name. I looked it up, but I don't remember his name. Of course, there are actual tools designed and killing in mind for you to use. Like the fu that fully loaded handgun there. Let's see if we can find some lead hungry bozos. Lead hungry, there we go, sorry. <laughs> Guns have limited ammo and cannot be reloaded. Handguns can be used as melee weapons after running out of ammo. Sounds good. Get that gun then. Point and shoot. Okay. It's a twin stick shooter type when you get a gun. Oh, this is great. Yeah, the guns feel and shoot great. It's fucking beautiful. Wow. Support this guy, guys. You know, I dare say we make quite the pair. You with all the killing and all the baddie dudes, me bringing all the hype, it's meant to be. <laughs> so I say enough practice, time to take it to the streets. Remember, there is a full scale criminal takeover in progress out there. We don't stop it, this city and all the people in it, well, it ain't even worth thinking about. With you out there, we can't lose, or so I tell myself. Now come on, we've got some, we got our first major target to give a violent send off to. I'll tell you about them on the way. I mean, what can I say? This game, yeah, support this guy, guys. Support your indie, indie and uh, independent video game makers because some of these guys they really they have good ideas. Give them some funding, you know. This is your hideout. It's a place where you can customize your character between levels, unlock your new skills, and much more. The levels panel allows you to select the level you want to play. You can return to the previous level at any time. Okay. Sounds good. Even the menus are pretty good for somebody. Are you kidding me? This is one guy that did all this? Bruh. This guy has passion, bro. Unlock your first skill. Um, let me take a look. I already made fifteen hundred dollars. Hell yeah! And close window. Yeah, but uh, what's this? Combos. Oh, with the kick. Okay, okay. What's the other one? Parry encounter. Oh, this is this is the best. I'm probably gonna get parry encounter, guys. Finishers. Oh shit! Belly to back. Suplex. And what's his grapple? Bro, this guy has a lot of moves. Oh, and each one. Oh hell yeah! Oh, I'm about to really enjoy myself. This is fucking awesome. Use a parry to block enemy attack then retaliate using a quick counter parry and counter you know what unlock skill we're gonna start off with this shit boom boom oh that looks really far wow what's this okay i like the first one better can i get that one too or do i don't have enough 
I don't have enough points, but at least that's unlocked. I got the parry. Yeah, I can only unlock one right now, guys. But it's cool. It's cool. All right, we're going in. Rockets away. That's from Power Rangers, guys. I'm a total nerd. <laughs> Zahim, the nerd. Sorry, I try to use a Ace Ventura reference. I'm kind of old. The loading isn't bad. This is a PS4 game, guys, so this is crazy. You see what I'm saying? That's why the counters are there. This is the first... I know, I know this is going to be great. Collecting gold teeth from enemies allows you to unlock additional items in the game. Okay. Come on, fuckers. Bro, that's, this is probably the coolest thing in the... Yeah, this is what I saw in the previews, and that's why it was been unlocked. Fuck combos when you can do this shit. Obviously, this is... I'm still not at the precipice of what you can do, but... Oh shit, I can't block it. The red ones are unblockable? You know what? Fuck you, dude. Fucking bitch. Whoa, 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 whoa. Let's go. That was a karate move, straight up. Our first target is Lil Tony. <laughs> Real low life. Terrible scumbag. Human shape stain on the underpants of society. Of the city, sorry. I'm used to saying society. Lil Tony is the meathead who leads the bozos in charge of general street level crime stuff. Robberies, muggings, etc. Except right now, he's playing the part of violent distraction in the grand symphony of this friendly neighborhood takeover. Sowing chaos around town. I mean, never take your eyes off the stripes sort of thing. We take Lil Tony down, we deliver the first major blow to this whole mess. Let's start with the hub of illicitness, illicit, illicitness. This be, oh my god, my reading is all of a sudden bad, sorry. Is a mutation factory. You know what it is, guys? My contact lens, they get dried up and it starts to become blurry. And it only happens when I see words on screen. It doesn't happen when I'm playing the regular game. I think it's because the words are white, maybe? So, like, it's really shining over my face or something. I don't know. Explosive productions in overdrive. Will Tony wants us going big, like explode pipe or square big. <laughs> Death and destruction will distract the media and do-gooders give the other gangs cover to their dirty deeds. Wait, you hear that? It's me, Bozos. But literally, that's the name, Bozos. Bitch, witch. Yeah, you gotta you gotta use the counter with the with the with the weapon. I know it was gonna be something special. This is the first guy I'm gonna fuck up, yeah, because these guys are fucking assholes. Boom. Boom! He did a little bit of... Holy shit, he did a... He did a little bit of uh, Wing Chun there. Come on, fucker. These bozos are prepping to hit Piper Square. That's gonna put a lot of innocent folks in the ground. We better bury the, their plans with ASAP. Okay. Come on, come on, little Tony. Ain't gonna wait around for... Oh, shit. Some environmental items can be used as explosives. You can identify them using focus. Yeah, you, you told me that already. Oh, shit. I gotta remember to do that. Fucker. Bitch. Witch. That's why you need a fucking chair. This guy has a gun? Oh, shit. Take his gun. Alright, you guys are fucked. I'm coming in loaded. No pun intended. <laughs> oh shit, I dropped it! I dropped the gun! Bro, the, the sounds of the gun is so good. It reminds me of Source. Counter-Strike Source, believe it or not. But in a top view way, you know? Yo, who the fuck are you? Wait, don't answer. I want to be able to hear your bones breaking when I crush them. Oh. Some opponents use grapple attacks that 
require the player to press the pro appropriate buttons rapidly to escape. Okay. Here you go, bitch. Factory empty, but let's check out back to be sure no loose ends. Damn, that was quick. Let's throw shit at people that are too tough, you know? Oh, that's a big ass dude. Square, Paitsa, Plaza. It's all the same, but you know which one's the biggest. Freaking walking Wikipedia, shut the hell up and get the damn boom boom on the truck so we can level your precious pizza already. Pizza? And those are in Italy? You never listen. Alright guys, stop talking shit, I don't give a fuck what you're saying. Come on, bro. Wow. It's brutal combat, man. I love it. There we go. Hit the fat dude with the boxes. There you go, bitch. Witch. Oh, oh, karate style. Holy shit. That guy is targeting me. Yeah, I'm gonna just use Jackie Chan's strategy. Throw shit at people. <laughs> Phew, that takes care of that. Now for little Tony himself. This is his shiskeezy hideout. Bozo's Brotel. Or as he likes to call it, the Tone Bone Zone. <laughs> God, I hate this guy. Let's kill him. <laughs> the Tone Bone? Jesus. He's a freaking idiot. Level complete, guys. This is just the beginning. So this is just the beginning of the game, guys. Obviously, this game is definitely going to be on my channel. Oh, my God. What a bad grading. I don't know what I did wrong. I, I whooped some ass. I barely got hit. What the fuck is going on? Maybe it took me too long to get across the levels. But, yeah, guys, I definitely recommend this 100%. If you love beat-em-ups, you're going to love this game, guaranteed. And it seems to have a variety of moves that you unlock as... For what I've seen so far, obviously I'm going to beat it and go through the whole fucking thing. I just wish they would add a multiplayer mode so I can play with my buddy. Because this seems like the type of game that would be so awesome to play with your buddy. And yeah, in the multiplayer mode, obviously, put more enemies on screen, you know, extend the levels a little bit to the creator, I know, to the creator of this game. Yeah, thanks, man. You have good vision. This is This is really cool. This is really cool. I like this. Um, obviously, if you get more funding, you're going to improve the graphics and on whatever else. But as it stands now, I'm very impressed, even the way it is now. But yeah, guys, other than that, support this guy. Hope you guys enjoyed. Please like and subscribe when you get a chance. And like I always say, cook him.